What is today known as quantum biofeedback therapy rests on four important discoveries. First of all, Peter Fraser, an Australian researcher and creator of the Ness Health System, established that information and energy are at the heart of biology. In short, biology relies on having the right information to function correctly. For example, how do our cells know what they're supposed to do? What makes them break down and cease to function properly? How can we help our cells function optimally so that our body can recover its full abilities to self-heal? The answer is simple. We just need to feed them the right information. Uh, secondly, Bruce Lipton, a doctor in developmental biology at the University of Virginia, essentially created a new science around his investigation of DNA called epigenetics. In the classic view of DNA, it is set in stone and deterministic. In other words, once it's created, it does not change. But in a quantum vision of biology, epigenetics show that our genes are flexible agents that, depending on their environment, can create up to 30,000 different variations. Just look at a chimpanzee and a human, for example, whose DNA is practically identical. Epigenetics show that the environment, beliefs and behaviours can actually change the structure of DNA genes. Unlike the classic Cartesian view of biology, the heart of the cell is not its core, but rather the membrane, through which electromagnetic signals can pass at 300,000 km per second, transmitting information throughout the body instantly. Compare this performance to that of a dissolved chemical compound, such as you would find in man-made medicine, for example, that travels slower than a centimetre per second. Electromagnetic biofeedback is therefore far more effective and much faster than physical chemical compounds. Thirdly, Rupert Sheldrake, a doctor in biochemistry at Cambridge University, has shown that the body possesses its own electromagnetic energy field, called the human body field. This is a complex structured network of energy fields that run throughout the physical body and underlie our physiology. The human body field controls the information that is transmitted throughout the subsidiary energy fields of the body, which follow a hierarchical structure both within and outside the body itself, forming a holistic entity. Final discovery is that of the HeartMath Institute in California, which has established that our heart is the informational gateway to the body. The heart's electromagnetic field records and remembers everything that comes from outside the body, before relaying the information to our brain, which in turn relays it to our body. Because of the heart's fundamental role, positive emotions can favourably influence our bodily reactions, strengthen our immune systems and regulate our biological functions. For example, the heart's electromagnetic field extends to up to 3.5 metres outside our physical body. The heart is the first thing to develop in a foetus, well before the brain. And just as positive emotions can create a beneficial physical state, negative ones can play havoc with our nervous system and damage the body's natural harmony. Positive emotions can help strengthen our mental power to make the right decisions, as well as boost the immune system. The Genius Insight app uses all these principles of energetic information to stimulate the body's self-healing capacity. Genius Insight helps us discover where there are distortions and imbalances in our body field, and then allows us to send corrective information to the body to restore its optimal state of harmony and stimulate self-healing. Genius Insight will run an energy scan on all levels – physical, mental, emotional, conscious, spiritual and environmental – based on your unique voice signature, your photo and a written expression of your intention to heal. It will give you a detailed analysis of where there is a need for corrective information and will allow you to send that information to the body in the form of audio signals and electromagnetic biofeedback.